Never have I ever. Have you played the game? You know how it goes. This is never have I ever in real life with a rap. Let's go. Never Have I Ever is a game that pushes people to admit their deepest, darkest secrets. For example, Never Have I Ever peed my pants in Walmart and then screamed, It wasn't me, it wasn't me, please believe me. <laughs> I actually Stop played this game with my friends about a week ago. You wanna play Never Have I Ever real quick? Well, I'd love to. Only I was secretly recording the entire thing. And everything they told me they've never done, they were going to have to do in real life. Never Have I Ever gone bull riding. I've never gone bull riding. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, you're fat. Oh, <laughs> And the video that you're about to watch was not supposed to come out. Lucky for you, it is coming out right now. Okay, it's been two weeks since we played that game. It's 7 o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna wake the boys up. They have absolutely no idea what's about to happen. Wake up, baby! Wake up, baby! <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 okay, okay. It's me, it's me, it's me. <laughs> Was that real? <laughs> <laughs> People are gonna think that's fake. Okay, we're gonna jump in here. Get inside, get inside. Bees, 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 bees. Hey guys. Dude, get out of bed right hey now. Hey guys. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Birthday, celebrating something. You guys actually have no idea. How would we have any idea? <laughs> yeah. The reason I'm celebrating here is because I've been keeping this whole thing a secret for almost two weeks. You see, I hosted a fake team photo shoot to get everyone together, took photos of them, immediately deleted them, and in the middle of everything, paid the cameraman to casually bring up a game of Never Have I Ever. You all uh, ever heard of Never Have I Ever? Just to get to the moment that we're at right now, undetected. You want to play Never Have I Ever real quick? Well, I'd love to. Does this scene look familiar to you guys? Never have I ever. That ain't good. What you didn't realize is that we're now going to be playing the entire game of Never Have I Ever in real life. Oh, that's, a, that's really bad. I'm trying to remember everything I said. I'm sure you're going to remind us. Clip number one. You want to play Never Have I Ever real quick? Well, I'd love to. Never have I ever stolen something from a convenience store. I mean, I've definitely I've done that. I've definitely done that. Wait, no, what? what? We're going to post robbing a convenience store? You've both stole something from a convenience store, right? You don't have to do it. Let's go! Hey! With Beans and I, we have never robbed a convenience store, which means that we have to go do that right now. Oh, God. Now, breaking the law isn't exactly my vibe. You need to walk out the gate, please. Okay. Put your cameras away. Get the fuck off the property. So I had a real store staged with actors, cameras, and even cops to arrest Beans and I. The catch was that none of the boys actually knew about this plan, except for me. Beans, what are you going to do if someone starts screaming at I'm you? I'm going to say sorry, and I'm going to start crying. <laughs> what do you want to do? You want to walk in, and you want to put your fingers in like this and say, give me everything. Okay, these are horrible yeah, ideas. Terrible. I think we should have to go for it. I think you grab a wine bottle. Oh, God. So good. The boys just walked into the gas station, hoodies on. Imagine if the guy like, behind the counter has like a freaking double barrel. Let's go here. You grab one of these. What the F are they doing? You got it, you got it, you got it. Unless you want me to do it. <laughs> oh my God. Make a little diversion for me. Go up really closer to the register. <sighs> this is weighing heavy on my soul. <laughs> Bro, you're gonna be fine, don't worry, don't worry. Sam's gonna be so scared of what's next. I know what you guys are doing. Mm -hmm. I know you're shoplifting in here. We've had a bunch of people shoplifting. I need you to stay in the store until the police arrive. You just called them. You just called the police? I know what you guys are doing. They've been in there for a minute. Yeah, I mean, I don't know how much they're still. Oh, there's a police officer. Oh, what the? <laughs> oh, what? Oh, <laughs> what is happening? Wait, should we text them? Yeah, text them, text them, text them. I mean, they're gonna know in a second. Dude, they're screwed. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't know about this one, but this one was shopping. You need to go over there. Are you guys, is this like an arrest? Are you guys detaining him? Dude, what part of back the f up don't you understand? Let's go. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, Jesus Christ. Is this real? Yeah, I can't tell. Let's go get him. <laughs> Beans is so scared. You can see the fear in his eyes. What's going on? I can't. I can't. I'm so bad at holding it together. All right, this is all a bit to show you guys that shopping thing is bad. It's a bit. It's a bit. <laughs> Let's go, baby. You look shook up. This is just a lesson to everybody out there. Shopping thing is bad. Why did I have to be the one to learn that lesson? <laughs> Actually, wait. Why did you arrest him instead of me? He'd be easier to get in the car. Oh my god. <laughs> At any point during the day, any of us can opt out of one of the challenges. But if they do, they'll be forfeiting the glory belt. That's right, I had this belt made with glory printed across the front. And from now on, when the boys and I do videos together, we'll be competing purely for glory. So at the end of today, whoever opts out of the least amount of challenges will win the glory belt.
The next one is... Never in my life have I ever played football. I never played football. Uh, that sounds like fun. Yeah. That sounds fun, right? Who are we playing against, though? Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot to mention to these boys that we would be playing the baddest, most ruthless football team to ever walk the earth. And I hate when you do that. You lock eyes with the camera and just go empty inside. So ruthless, in fact, that I made a stop by my friends and Super Bowl champions, the LA Rams, who agreed to train us and get us ready for this game. So we're with Jacob Harris, the LA Rams, and Jake Funk, running back for the LA Rams. Let's just say the training process was interesting. <laughs> What is this? Is this like college football? Another NFL team? Oh! Oh, let's go! I'm in trouble. Can I tell you guys something? You're done for. What? You're done for. 42 chicken salad, hype! Oh yeah, there's no chance. <laughs> oh god. Oh no, no. <laughs> hey boys, there's a whole lot of them. But we got the heart. And we them boys. Chicken height! Oh god, okay, here we go. Oh god. Oh, oh, oh. No! No! <laughs> oh god. This was supposed to be easy, boys. So much for that. Oh no! Oh, yes! Too many! Oh, oh. Oh my gosh, they're actually so strong. Oh! Kill him! Oh man, these kids are crazy. I'm gonna run behind you here, Austin. You're gonna run behind me here, Okay, gotcha. All right. Three, two, one, go! Take it out! Yeah, it's a play! Get it, Tyler! Get it! That's what I'm talking about, baby! Tyler just keeps running. Even though us three adult men only scored one point against the swarm of eight-year-olds, I wasn't trying. We walked away from this experience better, stronger men, having learned one singular lesson. The one thing you can depend on with the swarm is they will always win. You can't beat the swarm. All right, boys. I feel like we're good here. We're done. What do you mean? What do you mean? Stop! Get in the car! Get Oh my gosh! I told you guys they were gonna be scary. Now the bit's gonna get less scary after this. Well, it depends if you think sharks, bulls, boxers, and streaking a live sports game are scary. Never have I ever gotten in a fight. I have gotten in a fight. Yeah. Who hasn't gotten in a fight? I've never gotten in a These fight. These two have never gotten in yeah. a fight, yeah. I have the reach of a T-Rex. <laughs> I don't know how to fight. Like, no, you, you do know how to fight. You remember the part where you fought me this morning? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> You're not a boxer. No, 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 I boxed Jake Paul one time. No, no, he boxed you. Fight, bro, come on, fight. So we got a professional boxer that's your weight and a professional boxer that's your weight. And they're inside that gym right now. They're about to fight you guys. Wait, he's 80 pounds? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to fight. Okay, I don't go, know how to go. fight. Let's go, let's go, let's go. The boys were fearing for their lives, which is understandable. Except for Tyler, who decided that he wanted to fight just for fun. If I do this one, can I opt out of one of mine later? No. I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> but we were gonna be fine because we were at a gym owned by the world's greatest boxing coach. A man responsible for all of the greatest fighters to ever live, Freddie Roach. And under his supervision, we can crazy. all get punched in the face safely. I'm actually scared. You guys know, these guys are normally super loud and rambunctious. Being in this gym has humbled them. They're completely silent. I was talking all that smack out there, yeah. and you see a professional fighter, and then you're like... I've never boxed before in my life. Never? No. God bless you. Okay, there we go. Did you Dion just call me? Do you have anything to say to Mac? He's about to box somebody. Do you have any advice? Any advice, man? Just cover your face. I'll talk to you. Just right, cover here, here you. Here we go. Face. This man is stocked up. I'm actually nervous. Let's go, Beans. You're built for this. Oh, Beans, that was good. Yeah, Tyler. Offense, baby. There you go. There you go. There you go. Four. One, two, six, six times in a row. Dude, this man is buttery. He just weaves around all <laughs> Max punches. Get him, baby. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh no. Hey, 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 keep up, keep up. Dude, he just went limp for a second. Oh no, oh my god. It's like Sam will punch him once, the guy punches him five times. Dude, what's he doing? You gotta humble that man. Oh. This is not looking good. Leave it all out there. Oh. oh. When you go up to him, hit him. Oh, beans. Oh, oh. oh no. Bro, oh, you made it oh. every part of that combo. You got it, baby. You got it, baby. Let's go, baby. Get him, baby. He's mad now. There you go. Come on, man. Yeah, Tyler. Get him, baby! Oh! Oh, no. Dude, he's a weapon. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on! You got 
Watching all of you guys fight and me not fight. So you're gonna hop in right now? I mean, I'm not gonna hop in right now, but if there's any YouTubers out there who'd wanna jump in the ring, maybe comment you guys wanna see me get in the ring with. You versus Gideon would be like the best fight in the world. That would be pretty funny. All right, boys. You guys look tired for some reason. Honestly, that was awesome. I had fun, and then I got hit in the face, and then I just like, I don't really remember what the rest of it was. <laughs> I feel like you guys got your first fight out of the way, and it can never get worse than that. I mean, the rest of the day could definitely get worse. Tyler's right. The rest of the day will definitely get more interesting. The next challenge is... Never have I ever swim with sharks. That sounds like so scary, because it's like, unpredictable. That is so apt, bro. <laughs> so we have a boat waiting. 10 miles away that's going to take us into open water to go swim with sharks. I obviously coordinated this and have time to prepare. I'm still very scared. Well, how are we going to make sure they don't, like, eat us? I think we're just going to put meat in the water and just hope that sharks show up. Are you here to chum the waters? Yeah. Can yeah. I chum it while you guys are in there? No, yeah, you can definitely chum the water. Yeah, yeah. No! No, 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 no. yeah, no, no. Bad idea. The time had arrived and we were on the water searching for sharks. <laughs> it feels like I'm flying, Jack! We even saw, like, 20 dolphins. Uh, thing I've ever seen. But not a single shark showed up. So we decided to leave and end the video. Just kidding, you think I'm not gonna go get you shark content? <laughs> <laughs> the next morning, the boys and I immediately flew across the country to warmer waters in Florida, chartered another boat. I even paid a guy to constantly dump gallons of blood and just hurl chunks of meat into the ocean. And almost immediately, we were surrounded by sharks. We're about to jump in the water with these sharks because we love you guys. I love you so much. Speaking of our wonderful subscribers, last video, you guys voted on where you want us to come for the world's largest pizza party when we hit 10 million subscribers. The five cities that you guys chose. Drum roll, please. God, no. Los Angeles, hey. New York City, hey. Austin, Texas, yeah. oh. Chicago, let's go. My hometown, Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah, yeah. hometown. We're going to be throwing a pizza party in every one of these cities, along with making the world's largest pizza in Los Angeles. I am not joking. This is footage of me on a call with Pizza Hut, who's actually helping us make the world's largest pizza. To reserve a slice of pizza at the world's largest pizza party at any of these five cities. All you have to do is press the subscribe button. We're going to go swim with sharks now. You guys ready? Eric, look, shark. Oh my God. I thought I was excited until right now. Are you guys excited or scared? Scared. <laughs> What'd you say? I said I'm scared. <laughs> Why are you whispering? Because I don't want them to know. But it didn't matter. The sharks knew we were here, and it was time to face our fate. Oh! 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 Oh, yeah, I see him. That's a big boy. <laughs> Oh, Beans is freaking out. I'm good. That's crazy. Beans, are you having fun? I think he's crying. I'll be honest, if you're a fan of the channel, you know that I have a fear of the ocean. Something that has always scared me is this. And even if you couldn't tell, I was actually horrified to get in the water with these sharks. But after a few minutes of swimming around with them, the boys and I actually had a newfound appreciation for how beautiful they are. My favorite shark, I named Gerald, even gave me a little <laughs> high five on the way out. Such a legend. What do you think? I mean, that's like, that's the craziest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> that was beautiful. That was 100% worth it. That they started to just look like majestic creatures, and then I started to get a little bit too comfortable. <laughs> comfortable for oh one second. <laughs> Are you boys ready for the next ever have I ever? Oh. Probably not, but we're going to do it anyway. Lucky for the boys, we only had two stops remaining, but both of them are more intense than anything we've faced so far. We may have just gone shark diving. The sharks will not be the only animal that we're interacting with today. Do you remember anything about an animal? I never had a cat. Never no. pet puppies. Let's <laughs> see what we got. Never, here. never pet have puppies. I ever gone bull riding. Oh, no. no, never done that. Bro, we want a legitimate, like a live bull. There's no, way. There's no way we're gonna do that. You guys boxed, and I feel bad that I didn't box with you, so I will happily go first in the bull. Let's make a deal. If you break any bones bull riding, none of us have to do it. Fair, 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 fair. I'm like waiting for you to say this is like a joke. It is not a joke, but I do have a trained professional there named Cowboy Mike. Which one of you fellers is Cowboy Mike? Hey, nice to meet you, Cowboy Mike. This is Cowboy Mike. Now, he may not look it, but he's actually one of the most prestigious bull riders in the world. And today, he's going to show us how to safely perform the That's scariest crazy. sport on earth. Cowboy Mike, I have a question for you. How dangerous is what we're about to do? It's pretty dangerous. You're his son? Yeah. You ride bulls? Yeah. So you don't have any broken arms or anything. You're good. I got braces from when I moved all my teeth around and I got hit in the mouth by a bull's horn. 
Sick. You know, we could still just not do this. Well, that's true, <laughs> but then you wouldn't win the glory belt. So after some intense bull riding training with the boys, we felt prepared to move to the real thing. I'm gonna be honest with you, that training made me no more confident. Oh my gosh. You're gonna show us how it's done? Yep. Good luck out there. Oh, here we go, 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 here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh! 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 oh. oh. Oh man. Good luck out there, pal. Break a leg, as they say. I'm actually scared for you. Oh my god. I'm good. Yeah. Four wheel drive, though. If you backed out, I would 100% back out. I mean, dude, honestly, I might just not do it. Have you ever been skydiving? Yeah, yeah. First time you ever went out, that <laughs> going through scary. your mind, like, I don't know if I want to jump, but you did it, right? Yeah. So there's very few ways this goes good. Okay. You'll be completely I trust fine. you guys. Make sure I don't get hurt. Please. Oh, he's getting on the bull, bro. He's getting, there's really no contact. Ooh. Oh my gosh, bro. It's like crazy. This is like really scary, dude. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. There you go. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh, Come on, Eric. You're going to be fine, bro. Now keep that hand on the okay? Yeah. Go ahead, guys. Oh my god. I'm out of here. I'm done. I'm done. Woo. The scary part was that I was actually trying. I don't think I have any broken bones. So I feel like we maybe draw a short straw and decide who goes next. I like this idea. All right, whatever. Done. Oh, Tyler. The only other time I've seen this look in your face is when I threw you out of a hot air balloon. Go. Oh. Oh. We're out here to protect you, and this is what we do for a living, okay? You're gonna be all right. Go into it, positive attitude, you're gonna be totally fine. This guys, I am freaking terrified. I promise you, you'll have fun. He's not gonna hurt you. He ain't gonna hurt you. Here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> a lot of trained professionals saying he's not gonna hurt you. One, two, three, four, Experience. What's next? Oh my god. <laughs> Before I take this off and do some jumping jacks. Okay, alright. Yeah. Fortunately, today we would no longer be dealing with animals, but people. Well, what we're about to do is the last one. Oh, Did he actually get hurt? I never mind. I never streaked that in an event. I never streaked that in an event. So we're on our way to a baseball game right now. No way, dude. And we're gonna be streaking directly across the, uh, the field right now. That's scary, bro. Huh? This is a baseball game, you weren't lying. Well, actually, I actually have some shirts for you guys. I have never done this before. Whoever gets tackled last wins the glory belt. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, deal. Oh, deal. You better put your Crocs in sport mode. My Crocs armed in sport mode. The boys and I geared up for the last and most intense never have I ever. Who would go home with the glory belt? And who would get their cheeks spanked by the cops? <laughs> this is gonna be the most horrible idea we've ever had. I don't know if I should do it. I don't know if I should do it. I'm getting nervous now. You nervous? Yes. Wait, so you, are you guys gonna do this or not? I don't even know if I'm... This is crazy. I might not actually do it. I'm gonna be honest with you. Really? I got wrecked already. I think the glory belt's mine next time. Mac, you should join Nope, I want the glory belt. Oh. I think. Are you staying here? I think. Maybe game time decision. Now, boys, you might be wondering how we got these phenomenal seats at this baseball game. I didn't think about that for a second. I'm petrified with fear. I can purchase these tickets because I'm in control of my finances using SoFi. And let me just let you on a little oh, secret. By the end of this brand deal, I'm gonna give one of you guys a whole lot of money to invest. SoFi is a mobile-first banking app that lets you borrow, invest, and save your money all inside of one app. Can they bail you out of prison? I mean, if you invest your money correctly, you probably have enough money to get out of prison, yeah. I guess that's pretty good. You guys know that over the past year, starting a YouTube channel, the growth has been pretty crazy, and I really do attribute that to managing money well, which is why I use SoFi. Boys, I'll use SoFi. But as you probably know, it's not good to have money just sitting around. I'm whispering because I don't want to get caught here filming inside of a baseball game that we're about to stream. Eric, what about what we're about to do right after this? Which is why I love the SoFi checking and savings account so much because they pay 2% APY. That is 66 times the national average. I'm just concentrating on not dropping the soap when I go to jail. <laughs> Oh no, I'm so nervous. <laughs> this is just a facade. I'm in hell right now. I'm so scared. So if I made this entire video happen for us, and they also want to make something very special happen for you. One person from the Mafia is going to win $25,000 by downloading SoFi using the link in my description. That is the average teacher's salary for an entire year in America. I'd rather just be a subscriber right now. If there's any Airac video that I would click the link on in the description, it is this one. Are you guys ready? Yeah, well, can we just talk about SoFi all night and not do this? With the final inning of the baseball game creeping up, we would have to make our move soon. Roses are red, violets are blue. Hope we don't go to jail. Roses are red, violets are blue. I can't wait to win the glory belt. Remember me as I was. <laughs> Remember me Time had finally come to find out who would win the glory belt. Now, 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 now. <laughs> I've never done this before. The belt is mine. Oh God, he's coming after me. No, 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 no. <laughs> the belt is mine. You're fast. Ah. Oh God. Run for your life. 
Now this was a twist I could have never imagined. Seeing that we were all out running security, Beans was so mad about boxing earlier that he would rather tackle me and get us both out than have me win. Oh my god! Oh, I'm gonna get you! Oh, oh god! <laughs> Oh, 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 man. Yeah! That's a glory for your boy! Mac had done it. After days of ruthless challenges, Beans and I were sent to the station, and Mac righteously claimed the glory belt. But there was one last thing I had to do. Can you hold this for one sec? Let's get one clip of me. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, uh. Bye, right. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, stupid. Stupid. I love me some Arak, man. If you do, also, make sure you hit that subscribe button as we're going to react to a bunch of Arak videos and all the other stuff, that crazy stuff that he does and all the other YouTubers do. Um, but yeah, again, this was another Lift and Love Reacts video. Make sure, you, if you haven't, like I said, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Comment below what you want us to react to. And until next time, lift love, crush hate, just like that. We out.